Hey, what's up everybody? Today we're gonna work on a little neck mobility. You know, a lot of you are stuck on your iPhones all day here or we're on the computer and our head's this way. So we're gonna try to bring everything back and bring a little more motion to your neck. So I've got Ray here, he's got a five footer. You can grab a dowel here if you need to, if you don't have our sticks. Um, so he's gonna turn around so I can show you the setup. So we're gonna place the stick behind the back and your, hip, your hands are gonna be just wider than hip width. So what he's gonna do here, he's gonna create some tension on the stick, probably about 40 to 50% effort, and he's gonna drive the stick down towards his heels. So if you see, as he does that, you see his scapula starts to glide down. Now the next thing he's gonna do is he's gonna pull it apart, and now we're gonna lock those scaps into retraction. So he's gonna turn around, he's gonna maintain this position while we go through the drills. One more thing here, actually, if you go side view, when we go through the drills, we wanna make sure that we're in nice alignment here. So he's just gonna lightly pull his chin back. All right, so that's our setup. Now we're gonna turn around, we're gonna face the camera, and now Ray's gonna go through some motions. First, we're gonna start with some basic rotations. You can move nice and slow, start to the right. Just like all our other drills, you wanna make sure you're breathing. He's gonna come over, look towards me. And what I'm watching for here, I, I want to make sure that his shoulders are staying nice and level, right? And he's not rotating through the torso or the hips. So maintain that drive towards the ground and pulling apart on the stick. That's going to help you stay in place. So he's going to come back to center. So when you're doing this on your own, you can do five to six reps at that position. The next thing we're going to do is we're going to do some neck flexion and extensions. So same thing, pull your chin back. And now he's going to tuck his chin towards his chest. And we're gonna come back up and we're gonna go into extension. Very nice. So go to whatever range is comfortable for you. Don't go to, to that point of pain. We're gonna come back to center. So five to six reps of that. And then we're gonna go into some lateral flexion. So he's gonna to try to pull his right ear down towards his right shoulder. Same thing, what we wanna do is a lot of times we'll have people do these drills and they'll wanna side bend. So really drive, especially on this one, drive the left hand really hard towards the ground and that's gonna help you avoid tilting to the right. And now we're gonna come back to the other side. So this time the focus is gonna be driving that right hand towards the ground. You're gonna get a nice big stretch into the trap. Come back to center there. So five to six reps of that, and your neck should feel pretty good. Traps will feel a little bit looser. Upper chest will be opened up a little. So give it a shot. Let us know how you feel.